Here we are, hunting for kookaburras. We're out in the Cairns bushland. Tom, have you seen any? I think I have seen some kookaburras. I think they're upstairs. So here's the kookaburras in their natural habitat, in the lounge room, with the hockey sticks and a tennis ball. And proof that the kookaburras can read. Hey boys, I'm Simon Orchard. We're just gonna go into the room of the kookaburras today and just have a look around and see what the boys get up to on their day off. Let's go over and talk to Nathan Burgers first. He's pretty, <laughs> pretty boisterous. Burger, you had a big game last night. You're a bit chirpy today. No, I wouldn't say a, a big game, but I certainly wouldn't say I've got a day off today. We've some of us that are playing, we've got to uh, back it up again. I know there's a few guys in this team that can barely play a game, let alone two in two days. So we've got his boyfriend over here in the red hat, Kieran Govers. <laughs> Govs, how have you uh, found Cairns so far, mate? You enjoying it? Yeah, not too bad, mate. We could get the rig out, so shirts off, which has been good. <laughs> Is it true that uh, every night before you go to bed, you kiss both arms? Uh, yeah, I try to get Butters to do it too, but he says no, so I just <laughs> jump on him and give him a hug. And whose room are you in, mate, this week? Uh, the King, the smelly guy over there, and the big head over there. Butters, um, mate, how are, you, uh, how are you fitting in around Govers, Jamie and, and Burgers? They're all three big personalities, mate. Is it, are you doing all right fitting in with these guys? Mate, I barely fit in that room with, this, with the size of Govers ego in there. You've known to have the biggest head in the team. Is that uh, something that you struggle? Do you struggle to get your shirts on every day or things like that? No, nah, no, nah, not at all. I think it's just guys know that I'm the smartest in the group, so they try and try and pick on me about that, but I'll take that. And lucky last, Jamie Jamie Dwyer. Uh, how's it feel to be back in Queensland, mate, back, back home? Feels good. I love coming up to Cairns, and uh, it's good temperature up here this time of year. So, uh, yeah, unfortunately I'm not playing like yourself, but it's, uh, it's good to be up here. And uh, you're in with Burgers, two of the oldest guys in the team. Uh, do you have any rituals or habits that you do day to day, being so old? <laughs> no, we don't actually. We just uh, take it day by day. Usually Burger wakes up first. Here's my alarm clock. Here's mine in Burger's room. Um, usually what happens is in the Australian team, it goes on number of caps. So I've got the most caps, so I get to pick where I sleep. And most of the time when we're in Australia, we have uh, one double bed. And then there's another room with two singles. Uh, unfortunately, I got to, I got to room with Burger this time. We've got the ensuite, and as you can see, it's a little bit tidier than the younger guys' room. Where's Swanny? Usually, he should be in here about midday to about two o'clock, cleaning up and and uh, doing some the usual chores that we don't like to do. But yeah, you know, how's it going? This is the life of the uh, of the rookies that come into the Kookaburras. Um, Jamie, the king. How's it going, mate? Sorry, just got a you know shine, shine, shiny shoes daily uh daily thing that we got to do. As a rookie, I just have to come up here and you know just make sure he's smelling fresh for the ladies. So yeah, I'll go grab your cake, mate. This will be great for Jamie. Here's your cake, Jamie. <laughs> you might just want to be a little bit careful. <laughs> Italian stallion. Uh, we had a few uh, issues yesterday about Twitter stilettes. You weren't too happy with some of my tweets during the game. What, uh, anything you want to mention now, buddy? Anything I want to mention? No, no, you were uh, very good on my Twitter account. Um, some of your mentions about injuries, him being injured himself the majority of the time. Um, no, I sort of pulled through, and uh, thanks to Alan for looking after me and feeding me lots of right. snacks. GT, first game tonight, buddy. You had a, had a day off yesterday, so you're ready and pumped. Had RDA yesterday, so um, back into it today. Hopefully uh, get up front and cause a bit of trouble. Well, that's been a quick look inside Camp Kookaburra, boys. I hope you've enjoyed it. Have a good day.